So anyway, another successful trip. I didn't get murdered. In this, this place is, I mean, you would never think that this was a place to go unless you like wanted to come somewhere to be murdered. Um, hold on, I'm gonna turn it around and just show you. Okay, so I uh, filmed just a little bit of this new place that I've found. It is the biggest hole in the wall place you've ever seen. A friend of mine from church posted something about how they had a shipment of like cheap Target clothes. And that was a week or two ago. And finally, um, a few days ago, I came in search of it myself. Um, and I just want to show you some things that I got. Well, for one thing, uh, I've gotten this, this, this coat I got a, d a few days ago. This was a tar uh, Target coat, um, with the tags, brand new, brand new stuff, not used or anything like that. Oh, it's hot in here. So it, it's gotten a little colder here in Tennessee, so I just put on a big old a big old coat this morning and my Ugg boots, but now I'm warmed up, so I don't really need the coat anymore. But anyway, I just want to show it to you. So it's um great. It was it's a sixty dollar sh uh shirt, uh sixty dollar coat, uh and it has, but I got it for three. That's the main point. I swear I never finish my my train of thought. So anyway, it has what I love about it the most is it has these nice little nifty inside pockets and uh, well it doesn't, I was hoping it'd have one over here too but it doesn't um, like even my good North Face jacket my favorite black one that I wear all the time does not have the inside pocket it's so dumb and I really like the inside pocket so with that being said I went back and I got the green one they had a green one and like a wine colored one and so um, I uh, found this in a medium which I needed I'm sorry I don't have good train of thought today allergies are really bad we'll blame it on that um, so I got another three dollar coat um, and then I also got this this uh, backpack I thought it was great because it like it's square so you could fit a lot of this so it's got the top handle which is awesome uh it's got a big old front i feel like i'm on qvc um the front pocket with the zipper this would be this is going to be a really great travel bag and so you can open it way up and unclick these so that the i'm sure it'll just open really big for putting things in and out Oh, it's even got another zipper back here. Let's see how far that one goes. No, that goes about halfway. So, I don't know. Maybe phone right there. So, this one was $9.99. All bags are $9.99 unless you get two. And then it's $15, I think. Alright, so I've got some controversial things in here. We'll start with something that's not controversial. Um, brand new shoes, $30 shoes, A New Day is the brand. I mean, how can you go wrong with that? I'm all about a heel, but anymore I will not wear a stiletto because it just hurts my feet. I just don't have time for that now. So this has the big, nice, chunky heel, which I'm a very big fan of. Okay, let's see. I'm going to save my most controversial one for last. Okay, and here's the thing. This is why I got five items of clothing. If you get five items of clothing, it's $2.99 each. Okay, so if you're just getting one piece of clothing, it's $3.99. But if you get five, if you find five things that you like and want, then it's $2.99, so $3.00. Um, so I got these cute little paper bag pants, I guess. I think that's what they are when they've got that cute little thing up there. And so you tie them. 
And so I wasn't sure they're baggy, but I didn't know. I want them to remain baggy, but I don't want them to be, you know, to where they're just completely size human. Uh, that's what Jeff calls things that are like, have no shape. He calls them size human. So I got a size small and a size medium in the same pant. Whatever I don't wear, I will gift to someone who is that size. Okay, here comes, here comes the big dreaded pioneer slash pilgrim dress. I don't know, I just feel like, I love this color for one thing, and it was $3. It's the right price to, to try something like this, and this one has the buttons. So, I mean, you don't have to be completely buttoned up, you know, churning butter. I don't know, we'll see. I kept thinking of this one post. Uh, so, uh, somebody made a post uh, that I know on Facebook about how awful these dresses are, and for the most part, I agree. And have you seen that TikTok thing where, where they have all these pictures of people wearing this style of clothing, modern day people wearing it, and doing like chores like I don't know and they make it look like an old-timey photograph it's pretty it's pretty funny yeah, like this is my style now I'm, I'm a grandmother I got to dress like a grandmother now I don't know we'll see I don't know if you can accessorize those things and make them cute or shape it with a jacket or a belt I don't know. We'll see. If I, if I have success or if it's just hilarious when I put it on, I'll take a picture and show it to you. This place. And they have the nicest girls working in there, too. There's, well... I've met the other one now today, and she's really nice, too. I mean, and if you're looking for... There's bins that you have to really dig through. And so, if you're looking for a specific thing, if they've got time, they'll help you dig through bins and find your size, which is really nice. So, okay. Oh, and also, if you'll see this, it looks like it's a... It looks like a nasty, disgusting bookcase or bookshelf because it is. Oh, these people got my trash can I kind of wanted in there. They had a really nice trash can. They're looking at me like, what are you talking about, lady? Anyway. I mean, they have other things in there, too. It's not just Target and Walmart clothes and shoes. It's, um, like there's a swimming pool, like an above-ground swimming pool I see out there. There's some really nice suitcases I see out front. There's building supplies. There's tile. There's They get things from Home Depot, I think, too. Um, so, anyway, back to my bookshelf. I bought this bookshelf at um, Goodwill for 15 bucks. It seems to be my magical furniture number. So, I'm going to clean it up. And not today, because I just don't feel like doing it today. And I've got grandkids tonight, and I don't want to be tired. I want to be able to play with them tonight. So, I'll get this out on my porch and clean it up and paint it. And then it's going up in my craft room for me to organize things onto it. So, I'm going to go on. I hope you all have a great weekend. Or Actually, I don't know when you're going to watch this. So, I hope you're having a great day. Bye-bye.